Hello students, welcome back. Let us continue with chapter 10 circles. We will take a look at exercise 10.6 on pages 186 to 187. This is an optional exercise and not related to your exam point of view. But it is a good practice to solve it, so we will be going through it. So the first question, I will read it out for you. Prove that the line of centers of two intersecting circles subtends equal angles at the two point of intersection. So you have two circles having centers O and O dash. And prove that the line of two intersecting circles, line of the centers of two intersecting circles. So which line are we referring to? O, O dash. Subtends equal angles. So this line subtends equal angles where? At the two point of intersection. So obviously the two point of intersection of these two circles, as you can see in the diagrams, uh, in the diagram is points P and Q, right? Therefore, you need to prove that this angle OPO dash is equal to angle OQO dash. So let's go through the given through, uh, to prove that once again. Two circles with centers O and O dash intersect at points P and Q. So I have this large circle with center O and this small circle with center O dash. These two circles are intersecting at points P and Q. And if you notice this region like this is this one belongs to the larger circle if this is P and Q and this portion belongs to the smaller circle. So this is the common region for both the circles after they intersect. O O dash connects the two centers. So O O dash, this line out here, it connects the two centers. I need to prove that this angle O P O O dash, that is this angle is equal to this angle O Q O dash. So this is very simple if you see. In the two triangles OPO dash and OQO dash, I have this side equal to this side because they are the radi radii of the same circle. Again, this side is equal to this side because they are the radi radii of the small circle and this side is common, right? Therefore, the two triangles are congruent to each other by SSS test of congruence. Now, once you prove the two triangles congruent, you can simply say that angle OPO dash is equal to angle OQO dash through CPCT or corresponding pair of congruent triangles. So let me erase this and we will go ahead with the proof. So in triangle OPO dash and triangle OQO dash, I have OP is equal to OQ and O dash P is equal to O dash Q because here the reason will be radii of the same circle. And I have O O dash is equal to O O dash because it's the common side. Therefore, triangle OPO dash is congruent to triangle OQO dash through the SSS or side 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 test of congruence. Therefore, angle OPO dash is equal to angle OQO dash through corresponding pair of congruent triangles or CPCT. So very simple sum, please take a look at it. Thank you for watching this video. Hope this video increased your knowledge. For more such videos and a completely free educational content, log on to www.epathshala.org or visit our Epathshala YouTube channel. We have each and every question solved for maths, physics, chemistry and biology. So subscribe our channel, share with your friends, like our Facebook page and follow our Twitter handle for regular updates and important educational tips and also win Epathshala goodies. So what are you waiting for? Subscribe this channel and enjoy the freedom of education.